first. I've never read a book in my entire life, not all the way through. My real name was Conrad Pete Dominic Sandoval. That is the longest name ever in life. I was adopted when I was two by a Mexican gentleman. His name was Conrad Pete Sandoval, and somehow they got the birth certificate mixed up, and I got Conrad Pete Dominic Sandoval when I was 16. I changed it to just Dominic Kyle Sandoval. Conrad Pete, that's, that's my name. I went two years without cursing one time. I don't know what the fuck I was thinking, but basically, I was such a Jesus freak, I felt like any time I were to cuss, it was a complete sin. And maybe depending on who you are and how you grew up, maybe it is a sin, but I did not curse for two years straight. And it was the toughest fucking thing I've ever had to do. It was really, really tough. And now I curse all the time. Uh, not really, fuck. My first girlfriend ever was Lauren Wilson. We were in second grade, and we dated for like two years before I had to move, and technically we never broke up. I just kind of moved away, and that was it. Technically, hard to look at it now, I guess we're still together. Lauren Wilson, if you're watching this, hey, look what you missed out on. I went six months without masturbating. And for a man in high school, that is really, really tough. So let's not call it masturbation, because I don't want to paint that in your head. So I'm going to say, Green, give me something. Chicken. I didn't chicken for six months. When I was finally doing the chicken, when I was, <laughs> I finally did the chicken, and right when the chicken had bopped, um, I literally dropped to my knees and started repenting and praying and asking for forgiveness. And I was like literally crying on my knees to only realize after I asked for forgiveness, I looked down and the bock was still in my hand. <laughs> this guy, Tim Meadows, famous comedian, SNL and Woody Tang and all that stuff, is actually my uncle. We've never actually met, but it's kind of a crazy thing. His brother had chickened my aunt. And they had kids, and those are my cousins, so technically, he's like my second uncle, but we're still related. As you can see, the resemblance, obviously, right? I have this secret obsession with trucks. I absolutely love trucks. My next car will be a truck, Tundra. I just lift it. I just feel like the small guy in a big truck just makes me feel a lot bigger than I actually am. I love skipping numbers. There's a bunch of things I hate about fans. By fans, I mean you watching at home, whoever's watching this. If you're a fan of my stuff, there's a bunch of things I hate about you guys. And I'm gonna go through them right now. One, I hate that I can't meet all you guys because I would love to meet every single one of you because you guys support me and I just love you guys. I hate that I can't hug you guys. And what better way to show love than to give you guys a nice fat ass hug? And last but not least, I hate that you guys truly don't know how grateful I am for you all. Your guys' comments, your tweets, your Instagrams, your Snapchat. Everything you guys send to me literally means more to me than you guys can ever imagine. And I hate that I physically can't be there to thank you guys and just to tell you how much I'm grateful and how much I absolutely love you. So, yeah, I love you guys and, uh, yeah, that's it. I'm gonna go chicken now. Green, you wanna touch my chicken? Leave your next 10 idea in the comment box below and I'll try and get to it. Uh, thank you guys so much for hanging out and I'll see you guys next time. Peace! You mean like this? We got this? sand, we got coconuts, and we got d tricks. What else do we need? Pig roast or hula girls? Look at this.